Hey everyone, Peter Villegas here. It's Chick Flick Week on Money in the Movies. This week I'll be reviewing the classic chick flick film, Pretty Woman, which actually has a rather complicated subplot commentary on corporate finance. The film came out in 1990, at the end of the go-go 80s. In the 80s, a rather dubious financial practice became popular, and that practice was known as the leveraged buyout with a bust-up takeover. Simply put, this is a practice of buying a company not to improve it, but to destroy it, literally ripping it apart and selling off the pieces for a quick profit. I'll get into how these leveraged buyouts actually work, and I'll discuss the financial and moral consequences of them. This week, I will also review Confessions of a Shopaholic, which chronicles the life of shopaholic Isla Fisher as she runs away from a relentless debt collector. In this episode, I'll discuss something called the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act, which is the body of legislation that governs debt collectors. I'll discuss what they can do, and more importantly, what they cannot do. And be sure to check out my Money in the Movies second reel episode of Confessions of a Shopaholic. If you are being chased by a debt collector, I'll tell you exactly how to handle them and protect your credit during the process. My goal on this show is to entertain, enlighten, and enrich you. So I hope you will join me on Money in the Movies.